seems kind of awkward, but in this fight, he's not the one. There's a big left hand, and down goes Romero. It's over. That's it. No. Shout out to Javante Tank Davis. What a knockout, man. It took six rounds to do it. It seemed to be uh, from the opening start, Javante was just feeling his way out. Tank was just feeling everything out with Roley, man. Roley was very unorthodox tonight. He did land some big shots. You know, it was crazy. We about to get into it. Everybody hit that like button. It's Flight Sports TV. Shout out to Kid Austin. You already know what it is. Floyd, Kid Austin, Schofield. Y'all do your homework. It's Flight Sports. Tank Davis, man. This guy improved his record to 27 wins and another knockout, which improves to 25 wins, by the way, a knockout. I'm telling you, Tank Davis is just proven to be a superstar. The next fight could be electrifying. You know, uh, let's see what this is about. Right after the fight, you know, he stated, it. you know, when the, when the microphones were on him, there's no chains, there's no leashes on him now. So it's looking like he, he <laughs> the sky's the limit for Tank Davis. Who could, this, who could be the next opponent? Could it be Shakur Stevenson? Could it be Devin Haney's? Okay, who knows? Who, who, who could it be? You know, but there's a lot of big mega fights out there that need to happen. You understand? But tonight, give credit to Roley Romero. He was a um, he was a good opponent tonight. He showed a lot of confidence. You know, he just walked into a big shot, man. That was a wild left hand. You know that caught him. You know, but he was very unorthodox. He looked kind of crazy. He was a wild fight. I'm gonna keep it 100. It, it, he he. <laughs> He talked like he a WWE wrestler. It was the times out there he looked like he was a wrestler. You know, um, like I said, an unorthodox style. But he caught him one good, a couple of good times. And keep it 100, got to keep it a buck. He did catch Tank. At one point, I thought Tank was hurt him, um, midway through that fight. You know, um, because it looked like something had happened with his hand. And then it seemed like Roley was taking it to him. You know, but, I mean, it is what it is. What's next for Roley Romero? You know his record. I believe he he was he's fourteen and one now. You know uh, he has twelve wins. By the way, a knockout, but he just suffered his first loss. We got to give credit to these fighters. I know a lot of people are gonna clown a Roley Romero, but we got to pay homage to anybody willing to step foot in these square circles, man. Because box is not just a sport, but somebody could die in there, man. Um, we got to pay the utmost homage. Um, and respect for a guy to step foot in between those ropes. You see a lot of people don't do so, you know, so we got to put all of that into consideration because it's going to be a lot of jokes. It's going to be a lot of laughter. But, you know, give credit. He was very confident, man. He showed heart, you know, and he had confidence. It was at times, I'm going to keep it 100. Minus that knockout, I thought the fight was going even at some point. And if you look universal, like the people that may have watched it, Take the knockout for one second. It seemed to be kind of even. They were catching each other. It was times where they was exchanging shots. You know, it was, it was wild. I mean, that fight was crazy. You know, it was a very entertaining fight. I'm keeping 100. My eyes was like glued to the TV. I'm going to keep it 100. It was like, I didn't want to miss anything. You know, I felt like if I turned my head anyway, somebody was going to get knocked the hell out. It seemed to be at one point, I thought Roley was going to knock them out. It, it, it could have went that way. But... Tank Davis was very confident, you know, despite Roley catching him a few times with some unorthodox um, shots that he was doing, you know, he was still talking to the crowd, showing his training staff, you know, um, everybody in his corner that, hey, man, I'm feeling good, man, everything's straight, you know, they telling him to stay focused, he, he ensuring them that, hey, man, everything is good, man, everything, he was, he was like, his confidence was supreme, you know, uh, Tank Davis, he just... Yeah, that was that's what he exhibited, man. Just supreme confidence, man. I was to keep it one hundred. That's what I noticed. You know, Roley definitely was escorted out of the ring with his father. He was accompanied accompanied by his father. You know, people had to look him off. He he wasn't ready to compete. I know uh, a lot of people may have wanted to see the fight continue. The referee did a good job. Roley didn't even argue. You know, um, he got caught, man, um, and it was over. You know. We all know the power of the Tank Davis. So when you talk about um, all of these fighters in this division, they're very, you know, cognizant of his punching power. We all know that. So 
he 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 Tank Davis is a force out here in this division and he has his claim to feeling like he's one of the top guys as well. Um so this division is fully loaded. It's crazy, but these mega fights must happen. You know, we can't get deprived. You know, we want to see these fights happen and we want to see them happen um soon. You know, so what's next for Tank Davis? You know, um could it be Ryan Garcia? You know, um, it's, it's, it's very intriguing. You know, I don't know. But Shakur Stevenson, all the stars were out tonight. You know, they had it was a star-studded um, situation out there at the Barclay Center. Every All the stars came out. And it, it was a definitely a big fight feel. You know, Mayweather Promotions put something on the PBC. You already know what it is. It, it was a great, a great night for boxing. You know, to, to say the least, I got to definitely say that. But the sky's the limit. You know, next week you got the Devin Haney fight. You know, these fights just keep rolling and keep going, man. It seems to be a never-ending situation, you know, um, with great fights. This is definitely a great time to be a boxer fan. You know, and tonight it was just a, a great encounter. So it's definitely going to be intriguing to see what's next for these fighters. This Flight Sports TV. I appreciate everybody for checking with me. We definitely getting up out of here.